Hello and happy Monday. Welcome to Crystal's Invictus. I have a quick oracle reading for you and as you can see there are three different piles. So I'd advise you to take, um, make your selection just based on your intuition, whatever number calls out to you. If more than one calls out to you, maybe there's more than one message for you here. So we'll get started with the first card here. And we have miracles. Today definitely has the feeling of a light breaking through the storm. So, um, you know, maybe you finally made the leap into something or you finally discovered something there. This is the other side of an epiphany. I think that today would be classified as a somewhat surreal day. Um, in that you've transcended a certain amount of fear. So you may be open to experiences you wouldn't normally be open to and embracing those things. So that's pretty exciting. I'm just going to get you a few crystal wisdom cards to round out your reading. Any additional messages? But yeah, it looks like there's been some dark clouds in your life. There's been some dark times and you're starting to see the lights and the beauty. Abundance. Citrine. I am aligned at all times with the abundant energy of the universe. This powerful energy flows through me into every aspect of my life. So that's really beautiful. Just a reminder of abundance, miracles. If you've been looking for a miracle, this is the day when it's likely to appear or it's in the works. Wow. Okay. So there's definitely some solar plexus stuff happening here. These are almost identical stones. Um, so paying attention to what you eat, um, like the acid in your food, especially, um, you could experience some, um, faster metabolism or some, some, um, what's it called? indigestion uh, physically and then also energetically the solar plexus is the home of our pride our ego our sense of self um, it's your inner fire so it really gives you this um, uh, beautiful useful masculine energy to work with some drive there and then confidence confidence is exactly what I was talking about um, young masculine drive or confidence I am confident in all that I do. Yeah, and that confidence is really going to help you in this miraculous energy, okay? So that's what I have for you, pile number one. Thank you so much for joining. And if you want to book a personal reading, my information is in the description box below. All right, pile number two. Let's see what you have for this going forward today is a day of momentum so some things that may have been stuck for you some things that may have not been moving are going to start to move um, you'll start to feel this um, warmth on it's like stepping into the Sun out of the shade um, this is very similar to pile number one but in a different way it has a different feeling this is more um, you know, fresh cut grass, the promise of spring, um, those kinds of feelings are going to be restored today. It could quite literally be that the weather improves as well. Um, but I see you making a certain amount of progress and feeling really good about that. Um, so it's generally like a good mood kind of day. Is there any advice? Um... Tread lightly when you are expressing your joy, I would say, um, and 
don't place it in the hands of someone else. So if you know that there's something that um, is really important to you, um, not going to someone and being like, hey, look at this important thing and, and making it have to be important to them, if that makes sense. Uh, so we have fire agate creativity. I allow the creativity of my soul to shine through into my world. Okay, so creativity. Um, so if we're looking at the body, I would definitely look into your solar plexus and your um, your lower chakras. So your solar plexus, your um, sacral, and your root chakras. Sorry, it's the morning. <laughs> um, but this could be also that a creative project has a bit more fire. You have more energy to accomplish that definitely more energy coming in and shatakite kite teacher i have the divine wisdom of the universe within me and i openly share it with the world mm. so if there's something um that you've been wanting to write something that you've been wanting to communicate in some way sing um maybe you make videos maybe you do talks or whatever it is or something that you um, creatively that's um, a really favorable time right now to communicate that and to share that um, or at least to um, record or whatever it is it's really going to feel like the world has opened up for sure okay so that's what I have for you pile number two thank you so much for joining me today. If you'd like to book a personal reading, my information is in the description box below. Pile number three, welcome to your daily oracle reading. Let's take a look at what you have. Relaxation. Okay. This is definitely not a day to try and be social. So, um, I mean, a lot of us are not even able to be social at this time, but if, you, if that is something that is, um, if you have some sort of social commitment, it might be okay to take a rest on that. The other thing that I wanna mention here, if you are watching this when I'm releasing it, it is a full moon. It's the full moon in Libra. And, um, and we have this full moon here. So I think it's really about, um, you know, maybe if you normally do ritual or do some sort of, um, I don't know, like full moon thing with other people, this is a very personal full moon for you, I feel. And so what does that mean? Full moon is about releasing, is about, um, you know, charging in that light, in that reflective light. So uh, very much a time of reflection. You see this person reading, relaxing, um, but really bathing in that light, really being in that space of reflection. Mm, there's something about driving about driving a car. Mm. Um, the song, um, Tracy Chapman's Fast Car is coming into my head. I don't know if that is significant for you. And we have Scolocytes, Peace, yeah. I am an instrument of peace. This is the energy you want to sit in today. Just, and it'll be favorable for this to just be peaceful, to relax, to reflect, um, to not really invite other energies, maybe not even going on social media or talking to others or um, maybe getting in the car, going other places. Um, and this is going to be consistent with the, the rest of, the energies today and the other piles, Libyan gold tactite manifestation. I manifest positive outcomes. I really feel like this manifestation though is not an active one. This is a very passive manifestation where um, 
you're not actively acting on anything. You're just sort of trusting that you are, that it's already happening, that it's already unfolding. And you're just chilling because you know that it's already unfolding. It's already happening for you. All right. So that's what I have for you, pile number three. Thank you so much for joining. If you'd like to book a personal reading or take one of my classes, my information is in the description box below. Um, leave me a comment. Let me know how this resonated and please do subscribe. I'm doing a month of, um, these daily Oracle, um, readings and, um, yeah, I'd love to have you join. Take care.